How did you and Mr Eastoff meet? I was living in London at the time. A young woman full of naive dreams about Hollywood and stardom. You're an actress? I was an actress. I only worked on a few projects. A couple of plays and poorly made B-movies that fortunately very few people saw. Your husband is a talent agent. Didn't he find you any parts? I was just about deciding to give up on acting when I finally met Alistair at a networking event. But he said we shouldn't mix business and pleasure. And just like that, your career was over. What did you do then? Well, it wasn't too much later that I fell pregnant with Harry. You've been a housewife ever since. I suppose so. Yes. You know, maybe I was wrong to hire you, Miss Hart. Perhaps you ought to consider another profession instead. I mean, what reason would I even have for stealing the fire of Catalan? I own it, for God's sake. No. Your husband owns it. And seeing as though you haven't worked in two decades, I'm guessing he owns the house and, well, pretty much everything else. What are you implying? That you do have a potential motive. Perhaps things haven't been so happy in the East of household anymore. Perhaps you always harbour some resentment towards Alistair since his career took off and he refused to help you out. Maybe that's eaten away at you for all these years and now you have a way out. That ruby must be worth quite a lot of money. And what about Kenneth? What motive could I possibly have for murder? I don't know that yet. But you don't seem at all concerned that he's dead. 